Joining us now from Beaver Creek, Ohio, are Tiffany's father, Chuck Tabor, her husband, David Tian, along with their daughter, and Captain Scott Anger of the Xenia Police Department. Good morning to you, gentlemen. Good morning. Good morning, Maggie. David, let me, let me begin with you because we have not heard from you since this ordeal began for your family. You have understandably been too distraught to talk about it. What have the last five days been like for you and for that little girl, Lexi? It's, it's been incredibly hard. Um, not knowing what's going on, not knowing where she is, any of that. Um, you know, Tiffany is just, it's so unlike her for any of this to have happened. And uh, so, you know, we just miss Tiffany so much and, uh, and, and can't wait to see her again. I can't even imagine what it must be like for you to have to care for Lexi, take care of all her needs while wondering and worrying what happened to Tiffany. What do you think happened to Tiffany? I really, I can't even guess. I, it's just such a mystery to me. Is there, Captain, any new information or any hope that you can offer this family this morning? Uh, yes, we've been able to make some headway as of yesterday with some vehicle description and suspect or person of interest type of uh, information. Uh, we have an individual that we want to find that may have information uh, about Tiffany's whereabouts and we're very hopeful uh, with those uh, leads that we're able to locate her. We know his identity. We've seen him in the surveillance video, uh, but you have not been able to find him. Have you been able to make a connection between the man in the video and Tiffany? Uh, we've been able to make a connection, and um, it's not certain that they are together, but we believe there is a likelihood that they're together, and uh, we just need to speak to him and her just as soon as possible to try to um, bring Tiffany home safely and resolve this matter. David, do you have any idea how she knew this man? And, and, and please forgive me, I know that this must be a difficult question to consider, but is it even remotely possible that this is someone that she may have run off with? I would be shocked. I, I've never seen this person before. Um, you know, I, I don't know what connection uh, there is between Tiffany and this, and this man. Uh, but I'd be shocked if she was a willing participant in any of this. Mr. Tabor, what would you like to say about and to your daughter this morning? If I, if I could say anything at all to Tiffany, I would say, Tiffany, we love you, we care for you, and if you are able to contact us, please do so. We'd like to, we'd like to offer you and make sure that you know that you can come home, and we want to do everything we can to find you. There's a website out, TiffanyTN.com, uh, and we are doing what we can to find Tiffany and just encourage anyone and everyone to uh, help us do that. Oh, we hope for the best for your family, gentlemen, and, and Captain, good luck with the investigation. Thank you all. Thank you, Thank Maggie. you, Maggie. A lot happens early on The Early Show, weekday mornings on CBS.